Hello producers and welcome now to Monday. Hope you had a nice weekend. Well, sunny and pensive and or chatty today for the Tauruses. The moon is in Cancer, so emotional focus is on your mind, your attitude, how emotions can trigger mind games and vice versa. So you're easily triggerable when it comes to your mind, right? So don't get into a mental run today. Don't start worrying about your bank account. Don't let your mind go off course because it's going to bring your heart with it. But the real positive spin of this transit is this is the time to really understand your feelings and to communicate them. So this is the best day of the week to have an important conversation with someone that you've been uh, re you know, regretting having to do or not wanting or looking forward to. Today's the day where you're more articulate about your feelings. They will feel you as you are talking. And this is a great day to blog, talk to your best friend about anything on your chest or even see your therapist. This is the best time for that. So take advantage of it. The moon moves into Leo tonight. Now zipping around to the sun, the sun is in Leo. We're in chapter three of Sun and Leo. This month, Tauruses are creating a new foundation for themselves, a new way of living at home, a new way of living in their uh, self-nurturing. So now Tauruses are finally getting some sleep or eating correctly, that sort of thing. This also includes your relationships to your families. And for you young Tauruses, this certainly is your relationship to your parents, especially your mother. What we do is we kind of come out of our family adopting or not adopting, rebelling, one of the two. Either way, it's the same thing, right? If you rebel against your parents, you're still basing on what they think. It's just opposite. So joke's on you. But this is the time to really step into your own sense of family, become your own mother, and become your own homeowner, so to speak. And today, with Venus ruling the day, I think you're going to find that creating uh, that new home or that new space is more power than usual. Definitely a great day to go decorating, go to Home Depot, get some flowers, plant them, all that sort of thing. I know it's the fall, but still, Tauruses love flowers. Take advantage of Venus to beautify that home space or beautify your relationship to yourself. Now, if you're still harboring pain or resentment from your childhood or from some family or roommate situation, take the Venus energy and just heal. Forgive them, forgive all of it. You were all ignorant, frankly. That's why it all manifested. And you don't want to harbor that. It's only going to distort your light casting that starts tomorrow with the new moon. All right, Taurus, that's all I have to start off the week. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So...